I once had a conversation with a housewife seeking advice about her husband's undependable nature. She shared that he had closed down the small restaurant he had run for many years and had since failed in every job he took on. I explained to her that men are not born to be leaned upon by women. It's not wise to depend on someone who is not dependable themselves. At times, we can't even rely on ourselves, so how can we expect others to be reliable? Although your husband may not like hearing this, it's the reality. Let's consider a hypothetical situation where your husband is dependable. What if he falls ill, fails in his business, or worse, dies prematurely? You would have no one to rely on. The only reliable support in life is the Gohanzen. Your husband is not someone to lean on, but someone to relate to with love. The same goes for children. You raise them out of love and not for any ulterior motive. As people grow older, some of them may turn to their children for support. However, when they feel let down, they become resentful and complain about it. They may have raised their children with the expectation of receiving care in their old age, rather than out of genuine love. This is not the right attitude for parents to have. Instead, it is essential to chant to the Gohanzen and pray that your husband will become an invaluable asset to the movement for Kosen Rufu and that your children will grow up to be fine adults. Keep chanting until your prayers are answered. These prayers will be conveyed to your husband and children, and their hearts will be enriched, causing them to protect you. This is the true meaning of love. The same principle applies to personal relationships within the Nichiren Buddhism organization. The chapter women's chief should not rely on the chapter chief. When leaders and members of various divisions work together with the Gohanzen at the center of their activities, unity and harmony will arise naturally within their chapter. A man who dominates everyone at home makes his family miserable and hostile towards him. If he shows concern for them and fulfills his responsibilities, praying that they will all contribute to the movement for Kosen Rufu, his wife and children will respect and love him. The same holds true for the leader of our organization.